Reach Out Lakota has added two extra days to their food pantry distribution. drive through pickup for families Tuesdays and Thursdays from 10 until noon. We have volunteers who will bring food out to them. So we bring them a box or two, depending on the size of the box, uh, of food. We bring out meat and milk and snacks for the kids. CEO Scott Stevens says they have seen families needing help for the first time in their lives. We've already given out over 400 boxes of food. So we've served over 400 families with food in just this, uh, gosh, two months. It seems like it's been going on for a year now. But. Get out of them. But the demand is so high, the need for food and donations is critical. It can be any of us at any time. Uh, during something like this. Volunteer Julie Abrams asked for donations for the food bank on Facebook. Now groceries are being dropped off on her doorstep. I hope it's not the new norm for too long, um, but you know, certainly Reach Out Lakota is there to help the people, um, you know, through whatever they need. A helping hand from one neighbor to another. You know, we're feeding people, but we're also, you know, having a chance to, to be face to face with them and let them know they're not forgotten during this time. You can drop off donations 24 hours a day at Reach Out Lakota in Westchester. They have sheds behind their building that's always open. Natalie Clark, WLWT News 5. To help that need, we are raising money to help schools all across greater Cincinnati support families impacted by the pandemic. Here's how you can get involved. Just go to WLWT.com. Click the SINFED Donate Now button. Already we've raised more than $95,000 in funds and supplies. If you want to drop off donations, we are doing another one of those days of giving on Thursday. Just go to WLWT.com slash day of giving for the location of the drop off sites. All right. If you want